this is what all of the work, all the, all the sacrifices, everybody else come down to. I've dreamt of being an, an Olympic champion my entire life and I finally get to do it. And get to do it in London as well. I don't think there'll ever be a greater moment than this in my entire life. And Ah, oh, just our oh, moment moon. Amazing, I can't even describe how I'm feeling right now, I'm ecstatic. A bit overwhelmed to be honest, for the whole experience hasn't really sunk in yet, uh, but it was absolutely incredible in there in the Bellagio, the crowds were amazing, and that really, really made it special. I'm just waiting to sort of wake up and, and it not be real, that's what I'm hoping it doesn't, but yeah, it hasn't settled, it hasn't, it hasn't hit me yet. It's just amazing, like it's amazing team to be a part of and I feel privileged to be a part of such an inspiring team. To have people like Chris Hoy and Victoria Pemberton on our team to look up to, it's just amazing. A uh, good break now. First of all I'll be cheering on my team in Laura in the Omni, which starts on Monday, Monday and Tuesday. But then a good break, no competitions again until about November. Really. Uh, the medal ceremony tomorrow because we finished later. Um, the evening session was nearly done, so they, uh, they they do it tomorrow. So I get to go back into the stadium the night of the 100 meter final as well, which is nice. It'll be an incredibly crazy crowd, and then I get to get my medal and listen to the national anthem. I'll probably cry. <laughs>